Hey guys, the Law Inspector here with Danganronpa episode 37. I hope. Probably, but, uh, where we left off last time, we were. Right. Uh, well, Hifumi and Taka have died. It's been about a week, it, so I'm trying to remember. So, Fumi and Taka died. Kyoko and Hiro are missing. Celeste got attacked. Uh, Toko's still unconscious in the equipment room. And that's about it. <coughs> oh, okay, sure. <laughs> Anyways, ice cream. Ice, ice cream. I'll scream for share screen. Oh my gosh. Okay. So, my sauce. Wait, getting audio from. What? No, I thought I was getting audio. Weird. Well, on here it gives me the option to like turn it all up and down. Okay. But I thought it was not gonna play. Weird. <laughs> Are you good? Completely forget. She's still unconscious in the equipment room. Okay. Yeah, you can just do that. Sure. Well. Oh right, her. <laughs> okay. Let's see, Celeste. Yeah. I can Celester Salo. You left her at the scene of the crime? Didn't have a choice. She passed out and refused to wake up. That bitch. Huh? So is she still unconscious? Damn. Hey, so you knew she was still up there and did and said nothing? Why? <laughs> Annoying little insect that clings to me wherever I go. We'd be better off without her. True, true. Bastard! You bastard! <laughs> I'm down. You forgot about her, didn't you? You have no right to blame me. Everyone, stop fighting. Right now we need to hurry up. Hurry, hurry, hurry back, hurry back, hurry back. Huh? Well, let me drink, let me drink a night, let me drink a swig of my nice... Pop! I think you just pop some people's eardrums, too. Oh. Can't take this anymore, I don't want anyone else to die. Damn. <laughs> okay, anime girl, calm down. Yeah, if something's happened to Toko, I'll never forgive you. <laughs> HMPH. HMPH. We tried out the nur nurse's office and bottled up to the stairs, heading back to the third floor. <sighs> we ran back to the cut room at full speed. And when we got there, <laughs> Toko! Thank God you're okay. Or right, but right away, I noticed there was something very different here. Hold up! Oh, it's gone too. What the fuck? Taco is gone too. What in the actual? So somebody moved both of the bodies. Now somebody, somebody moving Taco's was is a lot more believable than somebody moving a Fumi's. When you say what the fuck? So there are obviously like smear marks. It was gone, but also uh, that's strange. It can't be leg marks because if you remember from like from when we found his body, his feet were out of the blood. 
So it should have been his arms and head dragging, probably. Or just his, three, three, three. or just, or just his entire body in general, probably. So it should be like one giant, one giant streak, probably. So I'm not sure how there's only two little streaks there. It was gone. Taka's body, which would have been, should have been right here, had disappeared. And there was now a little boy's voice in the background. Actually, it's my mom. Oh, okay. I'm just used to it being your brother always. He's on the phone with my dad. Oh, okay. I just I just tried drinking my sun kiss when it didn't even when it still had the cap on. <laughs> Bruh. That's, that's smart move, right? There. That's genius level. Oh, did did I tell you about? <coughs> did I tell you about last night? I I I asked my mom why the moon was lopsided because I forgot that there were different phases to the moon. <laughs> Bruh. Are you are. Do you wear a helmet to school? What? Do you wear a helmet to school? Do you ride a short bus? <laughs> no, I just haven't. I just haven't seen a moon, or at least not, I don't. I don't feel like I've seen a moon that isn't been full for several months. Hey, but you ain't been outside in that long. Well, uh, to go to school. Well, that's about it. I mean, there's no reason to go outside Not during barbecues the, or nothing. No reason to go outside during the dark, anyways. So. About bonfires. Did, did I just say during the dark? <laughs> during the dark. I am big brain. You are. I think. I think. I literally. I think my brain's turned off for Christmas break. I'm do, dude. Death to brain. Somebody murdered it just like they murdered Taka and Afumi. <laughs> Had disappeared. Oh, why is it lagging? This is. This can't be happening. This can't be happening, Joker. Bat. Oh, what to, what to, what to. Oh. Hallucinating all this or something. Maybe. No, it's not a hallucination. See, yeah, so I was right. So it should have been, like, his shoulders and everything dragging on the ground, probably. So. That's weird. I, I know I saw it before. And what I'm saying now isn't what I saw before. Yeah, that's pretty obvious. I, are, are we sure that this is literally not a blues clue? This is just right, right at our blues clues. No, the mastermind behind this all is literally blue himself. I, I need one pop. Uh. Okay. Um. Uh, diet cherry coke. So back to what I was saying. Yeah, this. Th I mean, this does just feel like a blues. This the blues clues right at our. Why are you not talking to me, sir? Have you given up hope? Right. So back to what I was saying. Doesn't it? Doesn't I'm gonna. This, I'm, I'm gonna have to do. I'm gonna have to do my voices a little soft. Doesn't just. Doesn't this just feel like a rated R Blues Clues episode? In our Blues Clues. Yeah. It's all gonna disappear too. <laughs> oh God. Yeah, that was really soft. It's like. It's like. It's it's like the first few episodes of DDLC up in here. My voice is dying. Yeah. Constant laughter. I want to when I well I want to be a little soft about it. There's latent stuff. Oh yeah yeah. To be fair, the only the only character that is really loud that you have to voice is Owie anyway so. 
talk at this pier too? There you go, that's good. Uh, but... I, I wonder if, like, the mastermind of this entire thing is just blue. Stop talking. Like the dog. <laughs> I'll make some chicken and noodles. <clears throat> chicken and noodles? Oh. That's pretty cool. Grandma was here earlier and she just came over and made some chicken and noodles. Don't you love it whenever your grandma comes to your house and makes dinner? Yeah. And the only thing that ever gets flavored with is salt and pepper. What? The, the only thing it ever gets, the only thing your food ever gets flavored with with your grandmother is salt and pepper. My grandma likes to branch out. <laughs> yeah, mine doesn't, but my dad, he does a lot of different stuff. We had some Texas Roadhouse ribs today, though. That was exquisite. Ooh. That was some of the best meat I have ever had. Dude, I've been get, I've been be becoming more and more of like a steak fan and pork chop fan. No, it's I just love meat. <laughs> I used to like meat very much. I eat burgers and stuff. But I did not used to like on the bone like in like bone in chicken. <laughs> huh, strange. But anyways, let's continue with game. Anyway, an easy voice to voice. Voice 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 voice. I'm saying disappeared. Like you, you do. Oh, crap! You, you do uh, Biaki's voice very well. I thank you, yes. good sir. Doobly. Well, I'm not gonna lie to you. I do miss smoking Grandma Sakura. Oh yeah, smoking Granny Sakura. I remember when they first invented chocolate. I remember when they first invented chocolate. <laughs> oh, I did it! They always hated it. Okay, anyways. I remember when they first invented chocolate. <laughs> okay, anyway, with Bayakuya. Too gammy. Togami. Talk to me. Talk to me. Vanish into thin air. Obviously, whoever did this is hidden body, you fucking retards. <laughs> but, why would they do Short that? Short looking ass. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but, but why would they do that? <laughs> I could possibly be imagined. Okay. Her Celeste, her grunting for no reason. Celestia, loading bird. Celestia. Celestia, what in the world? Hail. The hail. The hail. The Anyway, our costume <laughs> suspect is clearly continuing his crime spree. I cannot speak for crime. Like a uh, crime. I. <laughs> oh. Uh, oh, cream chicken. For some reason, it's like so doing Celeste's voice makes me run out of the breast breath very easily. You run out of breast milk. Yeah, just like Natsuki. I'll become malnutritious. Nutritious. <laughs> <laughs> My God. Oh, same brain. Mm. Let's try this again. JK, what a fucking legend, bro. <laughs> he he says one thing, and it sticks with us forever. Like literally three words. It's probably one of the funniest jokes. No. 
And I made that fucking uh, kid hanging out the window joke. <laughs> yeah, you did. Of course, of course, of course you did. <laughs> yeah, the viewers just to verify, we went back and watched some of those videos, and it was me that made the joke. It was like two. It was two days ago. That was yesterday. No, no, it was two days ago. Cause we didn't do anything yesterday. I could have swore. No, we did nothing yesterday. Oh yeah. Remind that I'm gonna just bed. Anyway, our costume suspect is clearly continuing continuing his crime spree. Crime spree. Oh my god. Crime spree. <laughs> crime. Continuing his cunt spree. Oh. Num mm num. -hmm. Gotta hurry up and catch him before he kills all of us. Not possible. I don't think you have to worry about that. Oh what hey, saying, it's daddy. Oh hey, it's a Matt Walsh celebrity pastry judge. Pastry judge. Yeah. Yeah, it's Matt pastry. Walsh. Pastry. Pastry judge. Yeah, yeah, that is, that is what he is known for, pastry judge. How do you judge a pastry? Just look at it and be like, oh yeah, there's a pastry. But but then there's all the the other Matt Matt Walsh, the professional Republican. Professional. How can you be a professional Republican? It's called working for the Daily Wire. Working for Fox News. Yeah, pretty much. Anyways, Byakuya Togami. Trump's a professional Republican. Oh, well, yeah, presidents and, you know, the dim professional. They are literally professional Republicans and Democrats. I'm a professional retard, so. No way. I don't think you have to worry about that. Huh? Ah! Hmm. Think about it. Could possibly be responsible for killing and hiding these dead bodies. For some reason, it always cuts off, like, the very first word of the sentence. Let me change my sensitivity, too, to make sure it's better. But it's only ever the first word. It's probably because I started. I don't know. And, uh, could, who could possibly be responsible for killing and hiding these dead bodies? There we go. Well. Um. Oh. Hmm. And Fumi's death cry went up. Everyone was here together on the third floor. It is so. After that, we split into two groups. Split up into two groups, I mean, I'm sorry. I have terrible speaking with this accent. Nachos, would you stop breathing into the microphone? Thank you, good sir. Okay. Hmm. Now this time... We all came here as a group from the nurse's office. In other words, the only ones that could have, could have done this are Hiro and Kyoko, who are still missing. Oh, hold on a second. Kyoko has an alibi for when Celeste and Nafumi were attacked. There's no question that she was in the dining hall with us. Hmm. Well, that is true. You seem very adamant about defending her. Perhaps you are. <laughs> In love. <laughs> I, w I want to see a spread of Byaku to start doing the, like the the playful like uh, arms around shoulders and like the the wriggling, you know, like they do. <laughs> oh, that'd be that'd be lovely. If if he just normal teenager. <laughs> if he just turns a, <laughs> just he just does that to make Makoto to embarrassed. Th that's not it at all. It's just that I saw 
Th I saw her last night. February we 13th. have reproduction organs that are not shaped like owls. Remember, it's February the 13th. Yeah, I guess so. It was February 13th. And I saw Kyoko. The first time I had seen boobs that were not shaped like owls. My god. Don't don't question how I've been able to see owies. It was in a premonition. Turns into turns into uh what, what was it? Not Final Fantasy. What, what, what was I about fantasy. to say? D Final Destination. There you go. Uh, the fi Final Just Fantasy go. Final Destination. Dude, <laughs> sneezing like my dad. He screams. <laughs> he, like he screams, sneezes top of his lungs. That's fine. Ah, uh, that's cool. And I get, and I get it from him, bro. If I don't, if I don't see it coming, I'll sneeze like I'll, I'll scream like a freight train. Well, anyway, yes, I do accept Kyoko's alibi. And yes, I do agree. She is pretty hot. Oh my God. She just turns into an actual. He's like once again. Like I think I think the funniest thing about Biaki is the <laughs> fact that he is just he could turn into a normal teenager at any moment, and it would just be hilarious. And that's. Hilarious. <laughs> Which means the suspicious individual we're looking for can be none other than Hero. I can't. I think my nose is stuffy, so I can't really do her accent, right? Ugh. I hate Mama it. stuffy. Which means the suspicious individual we're looking for can be none other than hero. I don't, I just can't, I can't really do it, I don't understand. Further means there'll be no more murders. Regulations are very clear about that. Oh, uh, that's right, there's a rule that says you can only kill a maximum of two people. Right, forgot about that. That is pretty good, not going to lie, sir. Yeet That's yeet. Right. As long as that rule is in place, there will not be a third murder. They were to break that rule. I admit ya! Admit ya without a second thought. I admit ya, grind it, turning into paste. By the way, did you know that fish paste can also <laughs> refer to shellfish like shrimp and crabs? E. The hell? The, the hell? Hey. Okay. Yeah. Oh, crap. Well, good thing it wasn't opened. Indeed. Let's see. <laughs> I know. So, since two people have been killed, there is no possibility of any more. That from the beginning, didn't you, Byakuya? Means you knew Toko was never in danger. Hmm. Still meant it when I said we'd be better off without it, though. I mean, he's not wrong. In other words, anyway, with that in mind, we can never relax and search for the two missing bodies. The two missing bodies. Two people have been killed, and their bodies have been hidden. The only two without an alibi. The only ones who could have done it is Hero. The only one he could have done it. But, he done it. but is he really the killer? Oh, that is a lot of crunching. And what about Kyoko? If she's not involved in this case, where'd she go? A photo. What's the matter? Uh huh. Uh oh, it's nothing. Never. We need to find those bodies. A little narrative. We can't move forward. So then. Uh, very well. Then let us split up and begin searching. 
There is no need to be afraid. No more murders will take I, place during I this mean, case. I know that. I mean, nothing I do. Hina. Still nervous. I'll come with you. Huh? Yeah, thank you. <laughs> no, I could barely hear hey, that. thank you. <laughs> hmm. Hello. Good, thank you. <laughs> Let's get moving. Yell out if you find anything. The Aki left the equipment room followed by the others. I have to try and find the oh, demons no. and bodies. Okay, we're right here now. So... I guess we might as well just go to every room possible. Uh, yeet. Um. Hayit, a Hayit, and Hay, a uh, Majit. My cheeks. The cheeks are red clapped. with blood. Oh. Cheeks are clapped. Hi, how are you doing? Okay, cool. So there's Joe Biden, Monokuma, uh, whoever you are, Cuba. an alien, and Venus. Oh, wow. rattled. Huh? The door must be locked, but it was not locked before, because we that's where we found the picture of Chihiro, Mondo, and Leon. Right? Yeah. So I'm not Okay, we're Oh, oh, lag. Oh, oh, turn, turn, thank you. Heat. Uh. Infected, infected. Here. So just. Was she really tight with this dress as Amber one? But what the heck is with this thing? Okay. Just the stranch. Very stranch indeed. Guess we can go into these rooms over here. <laughs> Getting tired of this. Yes, me too, Monokuma. Oh hi, Come on. Makoto. I'm just standing there in the to the repository. Are you yes. eating something? <laughs> of course. Indeed? Huh? You, you mean? I found them. If the Miyataka's body has both been hidden in the repository. I already told Hina and Sakura. We'll go on ahead. Their bodies are in the repository. That. Is Sorry. the that is the locked room? That is the locked room, right? And the art place. But then, how would have Celeste gotten in there? Is the thing? She just busted down the door. Busting down the door. She's she just has like. Are the bodies here somewhere? Is it over here? Has the deposit? Yeah, okay. The door not turned. I guess it's unlocked. Then I have no choice. No choice to be. No, it's like, so it's unlocked. Yo, yo, mama be busting, busting. If you know what I'm saying, bro. <sighs> Please stop. So I opened the door, and when I entered. I saw an amalgamation of flesh and eyeballs. <laughs> oh, hi. Yep, nope. there they are. The two bodies had disappeared. Were, were the two bodies that had disappeared were right there? A smell of blood made me gag. What I saw before my eyes was un was an unquestionable and unavoidable, unwavering re reality. Mama. And then I heard the, the announcement for the second time. Mama, ooh. Didn't mean to make you cry. Except that I totally did. After a 
certain Wait, amount huh? of time, which you may use however you like, the class trial will begin. Hmm. Oops. Why did it play again? What the fuck? Cause I mean, like the the announcement already played for both the bodies. Yeah. Played when it played whenever they, they were coming at the same, same time. time. Yeah. <laughs> so there would only be one. The fuck. And so we are here. I just add words for no reason. Uh, but without further ado, let me give you all the next Amatakuma file. I was going to hand them out when you, when you found the bodies the first time, but I thought something might happen. It was really hard to resist, but turns out I was right. Okay, you're very quiet. You just handed over already. There you go. For you. Now make sure to investigate with all your mental might and prepare See prepare for the class later. trial. See you later. Yeah, he said that, but whatever. <sighs> well then, now that we've found the bodies, all it's supposed to is to uncover the culprit. Yeah, I just, I just. Well, well, I just realized now that means that Monokuma's and Hifumi's voices can't overlap anymore. Oh God! Cause Hifumi is dead. Operation. So that means that I don't have any characters overlapping anymore. Ex except for, I guess, like, Kyoko and Toko, but that's about it. But Toko has, like, a stuttering Yuri. Celeste has an accented Yuri. And then y Kyoko is just Yuri. Basically, you can't do any other voices but Yuri. <laughs> yeah, well, there's also Natsuki. Snarkier and then voice. like the Sayaka voice. There's there's Yuri and then there's Natsuki and then there's the midway for Sayaka. There's the Midwest. And then there's also like the But then like Hefumi's and Monokuma's voices branch off from Natsuki's because there are there's are more masculine while well, hers is more feminine. But to be fair you got, you got, you got well, a lolly, a bear, and a 342-pound fat guy. Oh, God. It's a big boy. Yeah. It's about as big as Bob Ross's hair. Um. You know Bob Ross. What right? about Bob Saget? <laughs> oh, Bob Saget, even better, honestly. If I uh, know Bob Ross, he's, he's, yeah. he, he, apparently, Bob he's, Ross. apparently he's really good to watch when you're stoned, <laughs> drunk or something. Yeah, because being because being stoned is just a happy little accident. Much. And so are some children, but that's besides the point. Were you supposed to make you like really happy and like entertained by everything? <laughs> that's what I've heard from pe from people I, I've heard of like that use it. Like I, but I, but one of these I, days I want to move to like a weak legal state, and whenever I'm old enough, I want to try it. <laughs> Bob like, Ross, like Dan Avedon. Dan Dan Avedon tells tells like a lot of stories about uh, just weird shows and stuff he just enjoyed watching while stoned. <laughs> <laughs> it's great. But anyways, uh, Byaku Togami. Hey, back to Togami land. Well then, now that we found the bodies, all I supposed to do is Lana's left us to uncover the culprit. What the heck? Sit on! Can you be so calm? You're dead, you know? That's terrible! And gone forever. They're never coming back. Oh, 
It's too <laughs> awful. And it suddenly burst into tears. She clutched at Fumi's lifeless body. Why have Fumi and not I Taka? Who would do this? Go harder. You know, tur turns out Fumi died of diabetes before <laughs> the hammer <laughs> ever struck his head. Who would do this? I know, I think I'm pretty sure it's voice acting. Why? Why? Large, wet tears fell from her eyes. The tears landed on Fumi's cheeks. Did I just hear wet tears? It's actually sad to look at. Yeah, poor Fumi. Like, while he was a bit of a weird dude, it's, hey, I hate to see him die. Ew. This was some world of make believe that might have been able to open if, when it, that might have been when Afumi's eyes opened his eyes. I can't read, but this wasn't a movie; it was a book. A visual novel, to be honest, to be exact. Yeah, I guess it was. T it's like technically a movie and a book, if we're being honest. The fuck? Oh, Afumi! Alive. <laughs> this wasn't. He's alive again? Where? Am I? Mayday, mayday, get a med kit stat. <laughs> get a guzzle juice. So cold. <laughs> get a guzzle. Winter coming. Minis, get minis. He needs to refill a shield. Get a first aid kit. Fumi, wake up! Get him the floppers. Huh? Huh. The Spider-Man's. I remember now. Hope's peak. Come on, you gotta wake up! I remember everything before I met you all. A big pot. You gotta wonder how sharp that spike on his head is to be able to withstand a hammer blow. <laughs> I mean, if, I mean, technically, actually, if the hammer struck there, it would have just bounced off and Afumi would have been saved. I met you all. <laughs> this isn't voice acted for some reason. Memories are all blending together. He has nothing useful to offer us. Oh, the light. It's reaching out to me, like the tail of a comet. Hey, Fumi! Who was it? Who attacked you? Who tried to kill you? Who killed me? That's right. I remember their name. Y Yasu. That's a hero. <sighs> His eyes closed, and they never opened again. Death for the second time. Absolute, undeniable death. No matter how many more of Hena's tears splashed his face, there was no second miracle. Reality set it again. Hina, just do it to Taka and see if it works. <laughs> it's in some stereotypical fantasy world, you just can't restore a person's vitality. Honestly. What do you know, bitch? You have no tears, do you? No blood in your veins, no calcium in your bones. At least you have your vascular <laughs> hog. <laughs> At least you have your meat. Indeed, indeed. What about, what about your sausage? But, but how? But how does? But Celeste, how does he have no calcium in his bones? He would be jelly, or he would just be arthritic, like my grandmother. My grandmother. 
Although, to be fair, yeah, Biaku definitely does not have any tears, and neither do you. And you, Celeste, have no blood in your veins, because you're pale. Very, very pale. Yeah. Especially you have calcium on your skin. Honestly, I think that's... <laughs> that is... That is true. You are white as a bone. Stop talking. You just angry? <laughs> that's, uh, that's just... You're it's just like it's like the same energy of saying stay mad. <laughs> this Biaki in a Fortnite chat. Just mad, you you just mad if I killed you. Going at it, going at it like going at it was way of return just to leave us with those unnecessary dying no. words. Now this game has become exceedingly boring. Com. He said, "You have to hear right." If you said this, then perhaps you also hear a Hakakure. That is the only person that he so could in other words, to. With that, the case is solved. Assaulting people and even killing Taka and Afumi, and going so far as to hide their bodies. The criminal that hides his face behind a mask and wood is, and uses a bunch of giant wooden hammers. What is that is what this? hero is? It's true, I can't forgive him. No way can I ever forgive him. Kill two of my friends. That's fine. Anyway, it's about time I track down the culprit. A little life or death game here. Okay then. Hello. Time is not all that life or death. The trial will conclude without much trouble. Indeed. Yes, it, yes, it does look like <sighs> killer hog. It's going to begin again. We had to go through this one more time. I had to accept it. I had no choice but to go through with this to make it sure everyone survives. I just have to do it. Investigate. First, I better check the Monokuma file. The victims were Fumi Yamada and Ki Kiyotaka Ishimaru. The cause of death was each for each was a blow to the head. It is thought that they were both killed with a similar weapon. Very strange. That's it. Yeah, it's pretty strange. Got way less information this time than before. But we did see everything, so. That is no problem. After all, the events of this case unfold before our very eyes. Yes. We should know more about what happened in the Monokuma farm could anyway. Maybe. Well. Something else is bothering me. Hmm. One else has been missing for quite a while. We could do some outside of a building. Yes, indeed. Is he shat on a okay. school? Huh? <laughs> what? He shat Make on a nasty. school. Oh, yeah. But why? Are you talking oh. about Kyoko? <laughs> Perhaps. That's that's the line the Makoto oh. said. Um, uh, I doubt she has an alibi for when Celeste and Google were attacked. What if the killer wasn't acting alone? And an accomplice. An accomplice? Dun dun dun. An accomplice. Monokuma what are you doing here? Uh, don't be rude. I'm trying to answer your question. What question? <sighs> You're talking about accomplices, right? I'm pretty sure I explained Speaking this before, which, didn't I? During the first class trial. If there is an accomplice, do they this voice actor. Come. 
so you ask, and so I shall answer. Each murder is allowed to have an accomplice, but only the one who does the killing will get to graduate. So in other words, two people can work together, but one of them has no chance of profiting from it. Then there's no way anyone would work together, right? In other words, oh, hi, Mama. Butter, man. So basically, so, you can ha be an accomplice if you want, but there's no gratification in it. You're saying nobody w act nobody worked together this time either. Hey, um. Sorry, I can't answer that. I, it would accept the free exchange of information between you guys. <laughs> I just want to make sure you don't forget, no matter how much you might assist in a murder. Only so one black can words. graduate, and accomplice gets nothing! We only need to figure out what happened. That one black and... Who that one black and is who did the killing. Just right, just like normal. Well? Okay, okay, let me... Let me take this opportunity to clarify this whole shebang. The true blackens, so just one person. That's enough for no. That's enough for explainifying. Now it's time to the final battle between all of you and the blackened. Good luck to all the contestants and that pig over there. <laughs> so there can only can only be one blackened, and the accomplice wouldn't benefit. And I can't see any way Kyoko would be connected to this case after Maybe all. You're right. Oh uh, god, tired voice. Miss Trudy! Kyoko, where are you? I hope. However, as long as she's not connected to the case, it doesn't matter. To the investigation. Indeed. I have absolutely no doubt that Hero is responsible. <sighs> but for the time being, I suppose I can't wait for so further information. <sighs> Great breathing. Bill, don't you think we should consider a certain someone as a suspect just in case? Talking about the murders of Fiend, the genocide jacked. <laughs> I'm offended. <laughs> what in the world was that? You're really, you're really close to the microphone. <laughs> I've been looking all over for you, Master. When I woke up, and you were nowhere to be found. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> you were there, sex. milk sex swimmer, swimmer girl. <laughs> milk sex. Why do I get to be suspect? You are a serial killer. What the fuck? So when I'm like a special case suspect every time, I have an alibi, you know. About that. Heard a family scream. She was with me. The bodies had disappeared. Still lying unconscious in the equipment room. Plus, Taka's body aside, I can't imagine any way she would have been able to move Fumi's body. Yep. Besides, I can't kill every move I make. I'm not gonna kill someone when I know everyone, when, when everyone knows what I look like. <laughs> <laughs> they don't care me too, you make you think you're nothing. Dementia. What? Dementia? It's not the kind of thing you should be bragging about. Dementia. Let's see. On another topic, should we post the guard by the bodies so like before? Then. We can't have them disappearing again. You know that I can handle that. Oh, shit. That voice. You know that I can handle that. You don't mind, do you, Hina? Hmm. Sure, I'd be totally useless on the investigation anyway. It's all clear now. Oh my god. And that's the spirit. Well, and that's that. Let's begin. I just leave her to kill herself. 
This whole thing is so strange. But although one of us is an alibi, so figuring out who did it should be obvious, right? But maybe it's just me, but I don't think it's going to be as straightforward as it seems. Wanna come with file threes but now books section of your handbook. Okay, well I think that's where we're gonna leave it off. So anyways guys, two line switches out. Have a nice day.